Good evening and welcome back to NAZ Today. I'm your sports reporter, Michael Manny. It's been quite the past four months for incoming NEU freshman quarterback Angel Flores. He won Casa Grande's first state title in six decades, graduated high school early, and has now begun his college football career. I caught up with Flores at the first day of spring practice to discuss how he's adjusting to the college level. Just three months ago, quarterback Angel Flores led his hometown Casa Grande to its first state title since the late 50s. Graduating high school early, Flores now begins his college career with NAU as spring practice starts. Flores received multiple offers coming out of high school, but something played a huge role in his decision to come to Flagstaff. Just the coaches, how they stay connected with me the whole way, and just how they'll check up on me all the time. I knew this was a place I'll come here and I'll really be cared about. So really the coaches made a big difference in the recruiting and making me want to come here. Flores has spent his first months at NAU adjusting to the college level. A challenge, he says, was made easier by his coaches and teammates. My first couple months up here was, was pretty good. I, it was really cold, so me coming where I come from, I've never seen snow, so coming up here was a lot different, but adjusting's been really good. Coaches, players, players are really cool here. They welcome me as a family, so it's been quite an easy transition. At Casa Grande, Flores put up video game-like numbers. He's the only player in state history to throw for 7,000 yards and rush for 3,000 in a career. But his talent on the field isn't the only thing offensive coordinator Aaron Flugrad first noticed. Just maturity, you know, he's a guy who uh, uh, has two younger brothers and, and um, you know, him and his uh, and mom really taking care of those guys and um, really a mentor for them and his teammates. So a mature guy who's beyond his years. NAU opens the 2022 season against ASU at Sun Devil Stadium, which has a special meaning to Flores. It's the same place he just won a title. That's an amazing feeling. I was thinking about the state championship game. I was like, hey, I'm going to be back here my first game in college. So it's just a real special and surreal feeling. Michael Manny, NAZ Today. And in other NAU athletics news, the Lumberjacks women's basketball team may have come up just short of winning the Big Sky, but they've made a huge addition to their roster through, through the transfer portal. Former Idaho State forward Montana Oltrogi has announced that she is transferring to NAU for her final season. Oltrogi is a Phoenix native who played her high school ball at Xavier College Prep. Oltrogi played in 31 games for the Bengals last season, averaging 10.1 points per game and shooting 38.5% from the field. She also helped lead the Bengals to a conference championship win during the 2020-21 season where she was named to the 2021 All Big Sky Tournament team. Next season's schedule has not been announced yet, as the NCAA Women's Final Four is set to take place in Minneapolis this Friday, with the National Championship Sunday. Well, that's all we have for sports tonight, for, but stay tuned for your weather recap with Hannah Ware after the break.